So the Kansas City Chiefs needs a new receiver and Justin Jefferson is officially back. So I decided to ship Justin Jefferson to the Chiefs to see if he could help my home. And in this video, we're going to see how long it takes for them to win a Super Bowl. And now that the Chiefs got Justin Jefferson, this team is honestly not that bad. We got Justin Jefferson, Travis Kelsey, Rasheed Rice, and we also got a solid offensive line in Isaiah Pacheco. And their defense isn't half bad either. We got Chris Jones, Trent McDuffie, Ladarius Sneed, like a whole bunch of people, Nick Bolton. Justin Vree is honestly not that bad. So I feel like this team could definitely make it to the playoffs year one. And honestly, this shouldn't be that hard because the Kansas City Chiefs are always making it to the playoffs, the Super Bowl in Madden. So let's go. Don't you look at this? The Kansas City Chiefs end up 10 and 6. Don't get me wrong, Broncos have turned it around this year, but still, that's pretty crazy. And we end up being the six seed. Since it's only the wild card, and I got confidence in the Chiefs to beat the Bengals. So let's just advance this. Okay, never mind. I lied. Kansas City Chiefs end up losing to the Bengals, end up losing 35 to 28. That's pretty crazy. And it looks like the Philadelphia Eagles. Eagles will be the team that wins the Super Bowl. So we did end up getting knocked out in the first round, but Patrick Mahomes with 4,000 yards receiving wise, Justin Jefferson only having 1,000 yards is pretty insane. All right, so now we got the mystery box. We can either get an upgrade or we can get something terrible. And I'm gonna go with number two because Justin Jefferson was number two in college. And we get to sign three free agents. That's not bad at all. Free agency wasn't that good, but we are able to sign Tyron Smith, Josh Allen, and Jadavion Clowney. And with our three new added superstars, honestly, this team is not looking to have bad. Hopefully, we can win more games than we did last year and just be better than Broncos. Hopefully, we get the first place seed. So it looks like we're gonna finish the season 15 and 2, winning the division and securing the first place seed. So now we got the bye, and let's see who we play next week. And we're going against the Denver Broncos, who upset at the Dolphins. See, the Broncos are 10 and 7. I still feel confident enough in this team, so I'm gonna submit. Okay, so it looks like we're gonna be end up being the Broncos 24 to 14 going against the Indianapolis Colts. So we're gonna start off with super short field. Uh Colts end up turning the ball over, I think, from a pick. And we're gonna get a Justin Jefferson touchdown to start it off already. All right, to no surprise, we are absolutely dominating the Colts. End up winning the game 49 to 24. That's absolutely insane. I don't even know how Colts even made it to the conference championship. And for the Super Bowl 2024, we'll be taking on the Dallas Cowboys. But before we begin, I just want to check on season stats. Patrick Mahomes having a better season than last year. 37 touchdowns, 3 INTs, 4,500 yards. Justin Jefferson, so only 800 yards, 6 touchdowns. That's absolutely insane. I guess Patrick Mahomes believe in sharing the wealth, but still, you got Justin Jefferson. You're not throwing him the ball more? All right, so we're starting the Super Bowl down 7-0. Okay, let's see what we got. Let's see what Patrick Mahomes got. He got so much star-studded players. Even Isaiah Pacheco upgraded to a superstar. Oh, my goodness. Michael Parsons. Get the ball back. Get the ball back. Get the ball back. Let's go. Ooh, there you go. There you go, Mahomes. <laughs> That was a nasty juke. But Micah Parsons is screaming off that edge. Maybe we should go with something a little bit shorter. We do got this. We do got like a 60-something overall right tackle. So that's probably our biggest problem. We can't get flustered. Let's get it. Come on. Great throw. We got a whole bunch of people, but it doesn't matter. Come on. Come on. Justin Jefferson's open again. Let's get it. Come on. All right. After taking a sack, we are in his second and 13. She writes. Rasheed Rice, let's go. Way to hold on to it. Let's get it. Let's get it. All right, this is looking like, man, we got to slide to Micah Parsons' side because he is cooking. Come on. Come on, my homie. My homie, let's get it. There is Tony actually catching a pass. Let's go. Being tied 7-7, seven, seven, I think we can stop the Dallas Cowboys. To start the fourth quarter, we are up 24-7. Killing the Cowboys 31-7. 34-7. This is looking like a G. Freaking G's, let's get it. Kansas City Chiefs win the Super Bowl in year two already. And that Super Bowl was a little too easy. So let's see how many Super Bowls we can win in three more years. And since this is the end of the season, that means we get to open up a mystery box. But since we won the Super Bowl, why not open up two mystery boxes? Let's go with eight. Let's go with eight. Ooh, turn any player to expect it. And for the last mystery box, we get to, oh my God, bro. <laughs> we get hit with the loser superstar. Okay, so the player will be turning to X Factor is Trent McDuffie. And the superstar we'll be losing is Tyron Smith just because he's older and he's probably going to retire next season anyway. So but we did end up losing a few players. We lost our right guard. And also, we lost Legereus Need, our cornerback. That was tough because they both were 90 overall players. We couldn't resign them. They didn't want to resign with us. I guess they got the East Super Bowl and they're out. So this season is going to be really interesting. And I'm surprised Travis Kelsey is still playing. But last season, he was a 99. Now he is 92. So he might have one season max. But anyway, let's get into the season. Even though we got worse stats as a team, we still finished the season 16-1. Finishing as the number one seed. Let's go. Patrick Mahomes got even better. 5,200 yards, 
49 touchdowns. Isaiah Pacheco, 1,200 yards, 19 touchdowns. Hopefully, that just means Justin Jefferson is even better. Yes, he is. 1,900 yards. So close to 2,000. 103 receptions, 24 touchdowns. That's absolutely insane. Kadarius Tony with 1,000 yards. Hey, it's Madden. It's Madden, but hey, it is what it is. And we go up against the 10 and 7 Los Angeles Chargers in the divisional round. And I feel like we can win this one. And we did end up winning 45 to 42 in a crazy behind shootout. And that was like the only team that's stopping us from the Super Bowl is the Miami Dolphins. All right, we're starting off with ball. And let's see Justin Jefferson do that little Tyreek Hill route that got him open for the freaking Super Bowl. Let's get it. I don't know why my X Factors aren't showing, but it doesn't matter because we got freaking Justin Jefferson, man. This man just always get open. Let's get it. I didn't even realize Jalen Ramsey is the one sticking Justin Jefferson, too. Oh, never mind. Jalen Ramsey. Well, I don't even know who I'm doing. I think I should just skedaddle for the tutty. Skedaddle for the tutty. Lower your shoulder. Ooh, nice little yards. All right, we're going to try to get Justin Jefferson this touchdown. I think this would be great. He has been killing it all season. Ooh, never mind. Patrick Mahomes. Patty Mahomes got to rush it in there for one. Let's freaking go. Okay, so in the middle of the fourth quarter, Kansas City Chiefs got ball back, and they are up 21-14. Let's see if they can put this game mode away, and it looks like they're going to be able to kick the field goal, and I think that might be all. Oh, oh, yep, that is all. G freaking G's. Kansas City Chiefs going back to the Super Bowl again. And for the Super Bowl, we've been going against the San Francisco 49ers. Yeah, leave awards. Patrick Mahomes better win. Okay. Patrick Mahomes won MVP. So Justin Jefferson did end up winning Offensive Player of the Year. But let's see if they can get back to back Super Bowls. Let's go. All right, we're starting with the ball on the one. So let's make this a long. Oh my God. Thank you, Travis Kelsey. Thank you, Travis Kelsey. Let's get it. Keep it going. Keep it going. That was so close to being a safety. Let's go, though. I see one on one. This is like me and Curse with Justin Jefferson. Oh, no, it's not. But I can still try it right No! <laughs> No, no, no. No, we can't go out like this. Come on. <laughs> Yo, what in the world? All right, we can't go out this badly, so we got to try it again. Uh, dang. The sack. Okay, second and 19. The 49ers came to play again, and Nick Bosa is activated. Come on. It doesn't matter, though. Great. Hold on to it. Okay, this is looking like a cover four. I think we could not nah, cover four. I said cover three, but this is a man. I think we got Justin Jefferson wide open. Let's freaking go. Let's get it. Touchdown. We tying up the game 7-7. Let's see if the Kansas City Chiefs can win the rest of this game. Okay, to start the fourth quarter, Kansas City Chiefs are down by seven. They're able to drive down and score 28-28. Let's see. Oh, my goodness. 49ers, 49ers score. Can Kansas City Chiefs get it done? No, we lose. We lose to the 49ers, 28-35. 49ers got their revenge from the Super Bowl, like 2019, 2020. Dang it, bro. We don't get the back-to-back -back Super Bowl. Okay, the good news is nobody retired. We still got two more seasons. I think Travis Kelsey's like 36 years old. So that's good to see. All right, we did lose our Super Bowl, but the good news is we still get to open up one box. And let's see what we get. No, 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 no. We got to bench Patrick Mahomes. Oh, my goodness. Our backup quarterback is Eddie Osborne. We're going to try to see if we can get a quarterback in free agency because Patrick Mahomes can't play with us this season. Okay, so this free agency QB class is actually trash. We got Simon Howell, Geno Smith, Joshua Dobbs, Tyler Hunley, Zach Wilk. Should we go? Ugh, I'm thinking Sam Howell. He is 79 overall. I'll, I'll try to see if we can get him. Yeah, but looks like Sam signing with the Kansas City Chiefs to back up Patrick Mahomes for one season. We still got Isaiah Pacheco, Justin Jefferson. Our offensive line is still alive. It's pretty dope. Tyron Smith is still playing. We got these rookies who I don't know who they are. We got Travis Kelsey. We got Rashid Rice. Defense wise, Nick Bolton went up to a superstar. We got Jonathan Allen. We got Chris Jones. We got Trenton Duffy still being an X Factor. And since Justin Jefferson last year had a career year in touchdowns and receiving yards. And there's only two seasons left. So I feel like we should be able to open two more mystery boxes. And with the first mystery box, let's go with number six. Great for a superstar player. Okay, that's good. That's good. All right, and one more. One more, one more, one more. Add a former LSU player. All right, bet, bet. I know exactly who I'm adding. And the former LSU player we added was, of course, Jamar Chase. Just because I feel like we're going to need some more fire power, especially since we got Sam Howell at quarterback. But this offense is looking elite. This might be Travis Kelsey last year, which I'm kind of scared. He's not going to be playing with Patrick Mahomes, but we still might be able to get it done. And for the superstar player we traded for, we traded for Minka Fitzpatrick. We have to give up three first-round picks plus Kadarius Tony to get him, but I think it's worth it. We 
only got one more season after this. I'm like, well, I'm a little nervous. I don't know if Sam Howell can bring this team to the playoffs. We got two more seasons to win one more Super Bowl. All right, would you look at this? Kansas City Chiefs finished first in division for the third time in a row. Finished 12 and five, but not getting the first round by. Sam finished with 4,400 yards, 41 touchdowns, 15 INTs, which is actually a really good season. I say Pacheco, 1,200, 15 touchdowns. Receiving wise, Justin Jefferson with 1,400 yards, 21 touchdowns. Jamar Chase with 774 and Travis Kelsey with just under 1,200 yards. All right, now we got our playoff game versus the Buffalo Bills. I'm a little nervous. And to kind of no surprise, we end up getting bounced in the first round, only scoring 10 points. Without Patrick Mahomes, this was a disappointing year, and we don't even know if we're going to have Travis Kelsey next year. And Lamar Jackson ended up winning his first Super Bowl beat in the Chicago Bears. Yes, Chicago Bears in 2026 is going to be a really good team. And with another season finally finished, we get to open up a mystery gift. And I feel like this is our last season, so I'm going to go to. I feel like I feel like I should be able to open too. How amazing would that be for the last season? We end up winning it all, and we get to sign unlimited free agents. Okay, that's not that bad. That's not that bad. And let's see who else we get. Uh, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go five because this is year five. Add a former Chiefs player. And for free agency, the players we added were Jack Coughlin, Bradley Chubb, I and mean then also Christian Gonzalez. I don't know why Patriots let him walk, but he is on, on our team now. Any former Kansas City Chiefs player we had to add was, of course, the one and only Tyreek Hill. Pairing him back up with Patrick Mahomes, Justin Jefferson, Jamar Chase. This receiving court is absolutely amazing. And this is the final season of the video. So I'm feeling real confident in this team on offense wise. Yes, 100%. Defensive wise, it's a little shaky, but I think the offense is gonna score way more than enough. And to no surprise, we finished season 15 and two. Patrick Mahomes with 4,900 yards, 43 touchdowns, seven INTs. Rushing wise, Isaiah Pacheco had 1,300, 17 touchdowns. But, but receiving wise, with the added Tyreek Hill, Justin Jefferson had himself a down year again with 1,300 receiving yards, 14 touchdowns. Travis Kelsey, 1,200, 14, 1,854 and four. That's honestly, that's pretty insane. This offense is insane. And we got the bye week. Let's see who we play next round. And for the division round, we go up against the 89 Cleveland Browns. And we ended up winning that game. 31 to 23 and now was surprisingly we go up against the las vegas raiders I'm, that's really a shocker all right we're starting off down 3-0 but i got a feeling that this shouldn't be that hard let's go justin jefferson Ooh, that would have been a nasty juke but great catch let's get it you know what we should try we should see if we can get tyree kill over top with his 99 speed still oh no 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 but we got isaiah pacheco let's get it way to go third and goal and this is way more manageable I think Patrick Mahomes got to deal taking it with his legs. Let's go. 7-3. I think this is going to be a good enough lead for the Chiefs to hold on to the end. All right. To no surprise, the Kansas City Chiefs end up pulling away with the victory. 28-16 versus the Las Vegas Raiders. On to the freaking Super Bowl. All right, for the Super Bowl, we go up against the 10 and 7 New York Giants. We got a chance to win a second Super Bowl for the video, so let's go. Let's get it. It looks like Patrick, it looks like Travis Kelsey is going to be, nobody going to be guarding him. So you know we got to go to Travis Kelsey. Let's go. Great freaking catch. All right, we got a one-on-one -on -one with this cornerback versus Justin Jefferson. And let's see what we got. Let's see what we go. Oh, third and 10. Jeez, all right, we got to score. Oh, Justin Jefferson is not even in. We got Jamar Chase who's going to probably outburn him. Yep, he's going to freak out burn him. Let's go, Jamar Chase. I think that's his first touchdown we've seen in the video. Going up seven here, we are going up against the Giants, bro. There's no way we lose. And I feel like we can dominate for the rest of the way. And like I expected, we absolutely cooked the Giants. And we ended up winning the game 42 to 21. Also, more importantly, we ended the video with a Super Bowl. So in five seasons, Kansas City Chiefs with Justin Jefferson added on their team. And of course, the added extra players. We end up getting two Super Bowls and three Super Bowl appearances. That's really not that bad. I'm so proud of these boys, though. Let's freaking go. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you haven't already, please make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. I'm out. Peace.